Hi YouTubers. Today I'd like to talk about Holly Patterson. There's no one on YouTube, not yet anyway, that has made a documentary about her death or said any comments about it. There's been a few commercials that have mentioned her name within a second or two. But I'm here today because I know her. Or at least I knew her. She was my next door neighbor. I lived in Livermore for well, pretty much all my life. And now I live in San Jose, but... I mean, my entire family knew her. She would come over to my house, and she'd help my sister and me on projects for school. She was just the nicest person you'd ever meet. I mean, she was beautiful, spirited, young, and the fact that she died because of an abortion pill was just terrible. I mean, it hurt my entire family. The day that we found out that she died... I was shocked. Um, I didn't, I couldn't even realize it at the time. It didn't even hit me until a few days later. And I saw it on the news and I just, I would, I couldn't believe it. it she was, she was amazing. She was so young. I, I, it was just hard for me at the time. I had no idea about abortion. I had no idea what it was or anything. I just knew that she had bled to death due to an abortion pill that she had taken. And, I saw the funeral on television. I didn't even go because I was I was only 13. Like I said, I, I couldn't handle it. Now that I'm more informed about the issue of abortion and what it is, I'm here to speak out against it. Not only because it's a terrible thing. It's just, I mean, you're killing a human being here, but because it it affects human like women's health. She's not the first person to die from this. She's the only person to die from the abortion pill that's ever been recorded, I think. But she's not the only person to die from an abortion. There's been plenty of cases where people have gotten infections because the doctors have have performed an op abortion and forgot to give the medication to the to the patients. And I know w of one case, she was I think 16, and she died of a heart attack due to the infection uh, caused from the abortion because her doctor lacked the knowledge to even give her the medication after the abortion. Um, the clinics, they're not built right. They, they don't have enough care for the women that come in there. It's all unorganized. Um, there's, it's just, it's wrong. They, they don't really, if you look at it from a medical standpoint, it's not safe. And it's not safe for the women. It's not safe for the families of those women. Her dad is still devastated. Um, the last time I visited down in Livermore, I saw him. And I could still see the pain in his eyes. The pain of her, of his daughter lost. But I just want everyone on YouTube to know the pain that abortion has caused. For my family, for her family, for the world. Listen closely. Abortion is wrong. And it is unsafe. It needs to be overturned. I think the only way abortion would ever be viable is if it was a case of medical problems or rape. And that is only 3% of all abortions. 97% of abortions performed in America is said to be done for social reasons. And social reasons isn't enough. Over one million abortions per year in America. This is not something we need to overlook. This is not something that we need to just sit by and watch. We need to take action. We need to say what we think about this issue. And I'm here to speak out against abortion for my close friend, Holly Patterson. And I will never forget what abortion has done and what she has left behind. Broken family, broken friends.